Hey guys, so today I'm doing a little tutorial on the Alaya pom-pom sandals. I know I said I wasn't going to keep doing this pom-pom theme, but I don't know. Apparently, this is what's trending. And I don't know, I like all these different shoes with different variations of pom-poms. And I'm a little late to hop on the bandwagon with these ones because they've been out for a while. But I love them. I always love them. And I thought they would be the perfect simple DIY to add to the bunch. So today we're doing the Alaya Pom Pom Sandals. If anyone knows the official name, please write it in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe. Alright, here we go. So the recipe for these shoes are very simple. You just need some heels, some pom pom strings, some glue sticks and a glue gun, and you're gonna need scissors, which I forgot to mention, so I'm doing it now. Also, you wanna make sure that you get heels that zip up in the back. Strappy sandals that zip up in the back because if you get ones that um, buckle around the ankle, it's gonna be, you won't be able to do this tutorial, so. The first thing you're gonna do is measure the string of pom-poms against the front strap of the shoe. I used about six pom-poms, I think I cut it at the sixth one. And I just measured it, cut it right there, and you just bust out the glue gun. For me it was easier when I turned it on its side to add the glue because I didn't want it to drip onto the shoe so it's easier to just turn the shoe to the side and start with the glue gun. You don't have to do this any certain way, it's really simple. You could be messy with it because you're just going to end up covering the glue anyway. You have a little leeway when you put the glue on. It's like a one to five second window or less where once you place the pom poms on, you can adjust them a little bit. Glue gun glue dries pretty fast, so you kind of want to already have it in the right place, but you do have a little bit of leeway if you need to shift it a little bit. To measure the ankle strap, you just do the same exact thing. It's a little bit longer, so I used about nine balls on this one. And you just do the same exact thing, turn it on its side, put the glue on it, and from when I when I put the pom-poms on, I started from the middle to make sure that I was getting it, putting it on even on both sides. So it's easier if you start from the middle, so that way you know where the ends are gonna line up on the shoe so it's not off. And that's it. And then there were two. So you do the same thing on the other shoe, and voila, you have a slight replica of the Alaya pom-pom sandals. And if you want to check out how I styled them, again, you can always go on my blog, blogsandtrinkets.com. Don't forget to check out my other videos, the Aquazura, Wild Thing sandals, Feather sandals, more pom-pom sandals, chain heels. You know, I'm trying them all. I did get a great suggestion on my last video so I think I'm going to try those ones next. I'm really excited for those ones. So don't forget to subscribe to see a new shoot every week. See you guys then. Bye bye!